top performance throughout the game. Went more than toe to toe against Newcastle, that everyone, including myself, have praised um, this season. Deserve that well deserved praise. I don't think any team have done to Newcastle what we did first half. Uh, and we could easily, that's maybe too big, but we definitely heard other people saying uh, with a missed penalty and a marginal, marginal offside goal could have been up 3 0. Uh, or we could easily say we could have been up 2 0. That's probably fair. Um, uh, um, so top performance um, gave everything. I think it was two moments second half that um, unfortunately decided the game. A good action from Durrington. Uh and after that I think he's fortune to score. Um, I think he hits Davis' legs and there's no way in there uh, besides the deflection there. Um, and then um, quality from Isaac, uh, the 63 million pound striker. Uh, yeah, no, <laughs> but I don't know exactly what's wrong with him. Uh, we'll assess him one day. Uh, to, to, hear, to be fair, I haven't asked. I can't do anything about it, so I will ask my medical now. And my medical staff now when I come in back. I'll come back in. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think that's. Um, that's a good way to see it. I agree that the 45 minutes definitely um, is up there among the best halves we played in Premier League. Oh, yeah. Miss yeah, yeah, of course. I guess it's the law of uh, statistics that that one day he will miss one. Uh, I think it was to be fair to him. And of course, I always give uh, the keeper a little bit of credit, uh, Pope, uh, for that one. Uh, that I've had a fantastic season. I think the the ball moved. Just before he wanted, not before he wanted to take, but so we were a little bit in doubt of where he wanted, so that maybe could have affected him. I think it's a lot of um, uh, mental strength what he did uh, the second time uh, to put it in the back of the net. I sometimes wonder if you should do something about that when there's a penalty take. A lot of teams need to have strategies to put maybe a different take on the ball first, so we get all the abuse. So the right taker, then don't get the, the get the abuse. I think may, maybe we should look into that uh, in general, because decision made rightly or wrongly, rightly in my case, both uh, penalties, and then why not have it as a man-to-man -man duel, keeper and striker instead of all that uh, mental bit. That's just a question I'd like to ask. I don't think, by the way, I don't think that's because he, he missed the first one. If you've seen all the games back. I don't, every single time someone wants to go into Ivan's head, nothing to do with that. I'm just asking the question in general. I hope that's come out very, very clear when you put it out there uh, and don't uh, turn my words in a different way. I don't, no, yeah, no, in general. But I guess you saw the game, I saw. So you saw it. I saw it. You can watch it back. Then you can. Yeah, yeah. Of course, on purpose. Um, Thomas, I know you were just asking about Thomas. I just wanted to say, is it maybe too much for him to play three games in eight days? I'm thinking that. Maybe. And then I um, also just wanted to ask you about um, Eddie Howe's half time stuff. I think they had to change the game. I think we were so much on top. Um, and um, I think we were so much on top. And I think they. Uh, I think they, uh, um, of course, put a little bit of pressure. But for me, I saw, I saw it as two moments that changed the game, as I just described before with Jordan Turner and Isaac. I think it's important as well. I think it's the first time since we've been promoted that we've lost after taking the lead. Obviously, it's been a fantastic record. Yeah. I, when someone mentioned it, I can't remember, maybe five, six games ago. Uh, when we when we came in front, we, we never lost a game. <laughs> that's insane that we can do that. Normally, that's uh, big clubs like Liverpool, City, Chelsea, whatever that that do that. Um, us to do it is 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 yeah crazy, crazy, crazy impressive. First time we've lost the game in the league this season. Obviously, September. 
I say that to say predictable stays in April and last year, so that surely one positive thing that came out of it. That, that, that is very po- I think the performance is very positive in, in many, many ways. And I know when I cool down tomorrow and see that the sun actually rise again, uh, then, 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 then I know I'm very proud of the performance and I'm very proud of all the bits we have achieving. It's just when you're that close uh, and uh, yeah, you, you want a little bit more, uh, but um, it's football. I know you said about cooling down, but the players are great as well. It's not just kind of pressing on I'm trying to be quite transparent. Um, so again, praising for a very, very good performance. Um, uh, that, that should, uh, could and should have given us more than um, a 2 1 defeat. Who was it back to you? Again, about the penalty, I think it's quite difficult to penalty was either on the sort of near the touchline. Well, it was, was that something you discussed before the game? No, not in general. We just uh, experienced a few times before um, that we were aware. Uh, we, I can't remember what we experienced first. I think I was there against Norwich last year, and that we know, I can't remember the keeper's name, that he always. What's that? Tim Cruz. Tim Crowley yeah, always uh, very active on the take So we um, took Ivan away. But I think it should be the other way around. It shouldn't be the need to think about a strategy. I think I think we need to think a little bit in, in general in the sportsmanship of the game. I think it's too much of we need to be aware of the... We, we, I know the, the game management bit and uh, I know that it's not. It, we also need to game manage. Everyone wants to game manage a little bit, and, and and I'm not talking about that we don't do anything. But I think we need to look a little bit into uh, the dark arts of football. Uh, where is the the sportsmanship? We need to be aware of that. Is something maybe referees should be aware of. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, we also on purpose were um, a little bit more active in the in the um, uh, towards the fourth official today. Um, if you again, I'm talking about consistency. The guy, you guys, is coming to here every single time. Try to do the same every single time. Try to be calm. Not, not try to. I don't think it does me any good uh, to uh, to interact with him. But we know, we know that Newcastle they have that strategy. Jason Tindall always uh, always speak in the fourth official here uh, throughout the game. So we just have to be aware of that. What did you make all of the AR players? Quite a lot. I think they're correct, all of them. You were, uh, you were just aware. You were just aware. Yeah. Yeah. 